summer sun beating down on us, the race for Montgomery County Executive is heating up. Now, Executive Ike Leggett is in and made it official last weekend with a birthday picnic at Smoky Glen Farm where there were nearly a thousand people. Former County Executive Doug Duncan is keeping a low profile. Well, County Council Member Phil Andrews is probably out there knocking on doors somewhere. Now, the unknown in this race is County Councilwoman Valerie Irvin, who's making noises about entering the executive race. John, who's the winner in this cast of characters? Okay, I'm going to go out on a limb here. Um, I think this race is wide open. I really do. Okay. And for a bunch of different reasons. Um, you know, we have been um, with these two of the major candidates, Doug Duncan and Ike Leggett, have, have been in charge of this county for the last 20 years. I mean, when you think about it, there's a, there's a whole class of people who are like, do we really want to go back? to you know the same people I think I honestly think there's a, a question about newness I also think that the Democratic primary is that the factors in the Democratic primary are sort of wide open you've got the Washington Post who will have nothing to do with Doug Duncan and you have the labor unions who will have nothing to do with Ike Leggett and, and that's a Democratic coalition that you know is very surprising and there's no woman in the race well Valerie. I mean Valerie might get in but, uh, you know, th I think there's a lot of factors here that are fluid. And I, I would not say that because Ike is the incumbent, he's got the upper hand, we've come through a recession, the electorate is restless. I, I just, I, I think it's wide open.